I meant by that. That's all I meant by that. Don't take that shit the wrong way. Man. KG, everybody. All right. Thank y'all for coming out. Uh, all three of y'all. All three. All, all three of y'all. Thank y'all for coming out, man. Shout out to the rappers, man. Let me get y'all autograph before y'all go, man. Y'all gonna blow up one day. Y'all gonna blow up, man. But man, um, I'm looking for a job. Uh, looking for a new job, man. It seems like these uh, job interviews getting harder and harder, man, to find a job uh, because this one job uh, gonna. He was all in my personal life gonna ask me, do I got reliable transportation? I'm like, what the hell they got to do with dumping trash? I'm like, hell yeah, I got reliable transportation. My legs, bitch, my legs. I walk anywhere you need me to go. Shit. And man, uh, I went to the interview, before the interview even started, dude interviewing me, gonna ask me, are you from the Caribbean or something? Because we only hired certain minorities for this position. Man, I was mad as hell, man. I slammed my hand on the desk, looked him in the face like, yeah, I'm on. <laughs> I'm from the clean streets of Jamaica, man. Call me now for your retail reading. Shit, I've been working there ever since, man. Shit, I gotta get this paper, man. <laughs> and man, uh, gas getting cheap, man. Gas cheap, y'all better go ahead and get y'all gas. Cause gas cheap as hell right now, man. Gas so cheap, I could have sworn I seen gas pumps at Dollar Tree. Shit, <laughs> can y'all imagine Dollar Tree selling gas, man? It'll have every nigga in the hood walking in Dollar Tree feeling like Big Meats dropping $3 on pump now. I mean, they'll be walking in there with confidence, too. They'll be like, hey, let me get $3 on pump nine. Oh, and watch it float on the counter and just walk off like a boss. Shit, niggas that hurt y'all to make it, man. And since gas done got a lot cheaper, man, I've been seeing a lot of Mexicans on the road, too, man. And, and I love Mexicans, man, but Mexicans can't drive for shit, man. And some Mexicans know they can't drive, man. Mexicans drive so bad, I hit a Mexican, and they fuck around and pay me. <laughs> And look, as they go get out the car talking about, I'm sorry, my friend. Me no see you. I pay you, senor. I pay you. Shit, I had to pop my collar on his ass. I'm like, you goddamn right you gonna pay me. Shit, you ain't had no business trying to fit 30 Mexicans in the small car anyways. Shit. And man, my granny, she old as hell too, man. She always want me to drive her around everywhere, and it's crazy because she's scared of my driving, man. The whole time she ain't call me, she like, Oh Lord Jesus, just take the wheel, Lord. Oh Jesus, just take the wheel. So I let him. Shit, Jesus took the wheel and took her hand right back to the house. Shit, I was like, no bingo for you, Grandma. Jesus has spoken. Shit. And man, my sister, she dramatic too, man. She crazy and dramatic. She called me the other day talking about, Oh my God, my bills are just piling sky high. I just feel like killing myself. And then I heard my mom in the background like, I don't give a damn what you do, but you better come get these kids. Shit, I ain't keeping these kids. You plan on going to hell, you better take them with you. Shit, I'm gonna fall like shit, you heard her. Click, breaking all this stress over here, shit. We stress free, shit. And man, uh, a couple more things before I go, man. I'm getting tired of these females, man. They getting big headed listening to these Beyonce songs, man. And it's crazy because they walking around talking about, I woke, uh, I woke up like this. I'm like, how the hell you woke up looking like Rocky when he fought that Russian on Rocky Four? Shit, if you're a real man, you'll tell your girl. Shit, just because you woke up looking like a depressed check it out don't mean we all got to say. <laughs> Shit, take your ass back to bed. Shit, I know some mornings I ain't no about waking up next to my girl Isaac Hayes in this motherfucker. Shit, I wake up in the morning, her breast smells like, who is the man? That'll risk his neck for his brother, man. I'm like, bitch, go back to bed. You got some beauty risk to catch your bone. Shit. And man, um, this one girl, she gonna flirt with me and tell my skinny guys have great sex. And then when I had sex with her, she gonna come out the room and look me up and down like, mm, mm, mm. You know what? You ain't even that skinny. I'm like, yes, I am. I am that skinny. Shit. And man, um, these freaky girls, man, these freaky girls scare me too, man. I had this one freaky girl tell me she was gonna suck my dick till it explode. I'm like, whoa, wait a minute. Then what? You gonna put my shit back together so I can fuck some? Shit, I'm trying to fuck something tonight. <laughs> but shit, I ain't gonna lie for a minute. She had my dick harder than Last Level Mario Brothers. Shit. <laughs> and one more thing before I get out of here, man. Uh, if a female come to my house and ain't talking about smashing, man, she ain't getting no parking pass. 
Shit, how I see it, you getting hold or getting told, man. <laughs> Y'all, that's my time comedian, KG, man.